Welcome to AM Best Audio. The business of insuring construction projects continues to be a sweet spot within the U.S. insurance industry. The surety line of coverage has always generated a strong profit annually, but infrastructure spending measures are now poised to further bolster that solid performance. We're joined today by Senior Financial Analyst Robert Valenta and Senior Industry Research Analyst Christopher Graham. Both were involved in the research behind a new best segment market report on the surety segment. And Robert, let's start with you. We're finding that the demand for surety bonds continues to grow, but is the segment profitable? Yeah, we've seen the surety segment um, have strong profitability with combined ratios below 80% uh, annually over the past decade. Um, net profit margins have been in the mid 30% range annually, and pre tax return on revenues have been in the mid 20 to, to low 30% range over this period. Um, this reflects strong underwriting fundamentals and also growth in the surety market due to its resilient construction industry. So this is um, despite inflationary Im- impacts, which have increased project costs for raw materials, also skilled labor shortage, and increased interest rates, which has impacted the residential market. Um, raw material cost volatility has declined due to easing inflation and also a healing of supply chains. So all of this points to growth in the surety market and, and continued profitability. Chris, what's been the role of recent government spending initiatives on infrastructure projects? So, yeah, the Investment in Infrastructure and Jobs Act of 2021 has really helped spur some public spending on on infrastructure we haven't seen in quite some time. And all, all of this is done at a trickle. It wasn't just one you know, big burst back in 21 and early 22. It was designed to roll out over several years. And we're just starting to see the boost in public spending now. Uh, So this is something that certainly fueled some of the growth in 23. And I think we'll see more of it into 24. Customize your data experience. Best Link now offers an interactive company dashboard that provides company-level intelligence in a fast, user-friendly interface featuring interactive tables, charts, and sparkline performance histories. Customize the dashboard tiles to prioritize the insurer ratings, data, and analytics that best support your workflow. AM Best. Our insight, your advantage. Now, Chris, the report uh, also compares public sector growth versus private sector construction spending. How do these two sides stack up against one another? Private spending has always been far greater than public spending. Uh, What was interesting in 2023, spurred by the government bills of 21, uh, we saw that the growth in terms of dollars was actually pretty similar. There was a lot more growth. Uh, yeah, growth as a percentage in um, public spending compared to private. The dollar amount was was relatively equal. Um, you know, so again, you know, this is where yeah, I, I would expect yeah, look, public spending isn't going to catch up to private spending. That that's not going to happen. But as long as we have these public spending projects funded, we're going to see continued growth in construction. And with that, you know, increase in, in uh, short, uh, surety premium. Robert, what has premium growth done in terms of both capacity and competition? Yeah, we've seen we've seen ample capacity in the market due to strong profitability, and this um, continues. Um, and so we've seen the, the market is attractive to new entrants, and also um, for existing for existing surety writers, they're looking to expand coverages and grow their book. Um, So overall, this has led to soft market conditions and stable pricing for surety bonds. And we've seen that the heightened competitive environment will likely continue. Thanks, Robert. Chris. Thank you, John. You can find the full report online at ambest.com. For AMBest TV, I'm John Weber. Looking to get the attention of the insurance industry? We have the platforms to do just that. Whether it be AM Best TV, AM Best Audio, Best Review Magazine, or Best Day, 
Find out more by contacting our Advertising Services Business Development Team at 908-882-1706.